Hello, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Fallout 4 mods into Fallout 4 VR. So to begin, you're going to need a mod that you want to install. I'm going to be using Everyone's Best Friend. This is a mod that allows you to have dog meat and another companion at the same time. Normally, you'd only be able to use this mod in Fallout 4, but there is a simple trick to allow you to install pretty much any Fallout 4 mod into VR won't work with every mod and I suggest that you don't install mods that change graphics or environment as this may tamper with the Fallout 4 VR files but this mod should work just fine so going in you'll need to put this file into your Fallout 4 data as there is no way to use the Nexus mod manager as of the making of this video you'll need to go into Steam right click Fallout 4 VR properties local files and click browse local files you'll then get this that comes up and in data you can see this is where you install the mods and anything else you want so you can just open up your zip that has your mod in and all you have to do is extract both of these files just into the data folder Once these two are in there, you're now done in that folder. So after you've done that, you need to go into your Fallout 4 VR folder, which is in Documents, My Games, Fallout 4 VR, and open up Fallout 4 Custom. In here, you'll already have the display lines, but you need to add these lines under Archive. I'll leave these in the description, but it is B, Invalidate, Older Files equals 1 and S resources data does final and that is all you need in here that just enables you to use the mods once you've done there you need to browse to one last place you need to go to this PC local disk C users then your username app data local and Fallout 4 VR an easy way to get to this is to type into the bar at the top percent local app data percent and from here just the fallout 4 vr folder in here you may or may not have a plugins.txt file if you do you can just simply open it up you'll need to use something like notepad plus plus as normal notepad will not work if you don't you just need to create the file so you can see that there are my other mods in here but you need to add a new line in so as you can see, the .esp file of everyone's best friend is everyone's best friend.esp. So simply you put a star and then you type in the mod name. So everyone's best friend.esp. The star is very important, it's an asterisk at the start. If you don't add that, the mod will not be activated. And as soon as you clicked save on that, your mods will appear in Fallout 4 VR. So, thank you for watching. If it's helped you, please consider liking and subscribing. If you need any of the help, just comment down below. I'll leave any INI changes you need in the description, and I'll see you next time.